Okay, first things first, this is in a different tuning. It's in Dadgad, D-A-D-G-A-D. -A -D -A -D. That's the only tuning for which I know the names of every strings. Um, if you are not comfortable with open tuning, hang in there. It's not that hard to get to. I'll show you how I get to it. And there's some songs that are just way easier, for me at least, to figure out in Dadgad. Prince uses a lot of like ninths and sevenths and diminished chords and things like that. And some of that stuff you can just pluck with open strings once you figure out the bass line. So let me show you how I do that. First, let's start with the tuning. This is guitars in standard tuning. To get to dad, dad gad, third string's a D. Drop the first string, the lowest string to the D, and then D, A, D, G, A, D, the last string's a D. Almost there. Then we got one more. And that is the A, D, A, D, G, A, D. This is an A, so drop that one to an A. And you have Dag. Yeah. Okay, so the way I'm going to show this is start with the bass line, put the other stuff on top of it. That's how I figure out songs. So this is a bass line I stole from a concert you played in Canada. It starts with the second open string, then the lowest string on the fifth, then fourth, then open, then second, and then the second string open. Now, it may not sound like it works, but it does with the other stuff on top of it. It actually forms a chord. That's what's hard about Prince. The stuff he does and the orchestrations he do are really hard to play on a guitar. Anyhow, um, that's the stuff that's on top. It's the fifth and the or seventh and the sixth on the third and the fourth lowest strings that I play the bass. Then I go to this bass here and these two notes. Then I go here. That is a G in, or D rather, I think it opened in Dagad, and then the fourth string. And you can just leave it there for the low string. Uh, and then you can play this a couple different ways. I like to play this uh, fourth, what are those, from the high, the second and the third in the second fret while you play this, it's out of tune. But um, that's the chord that I play. You can also play it like this um, on the second with this string and this string. See, it works, doesn't it? It's a chord. If you, there's strings you have to leave out. Um, just look at the tab and only play the ones that um, I have highlighted there. So that's a song. There is the, you know, Rain Sounds So Cool part. Um, that's optional. And that's hard to capture on a guitar like everything else, but I'll show you how I play it. All right, the rain sounds so cool part. I don't have this figured out yet fully, but there's some synth that's doing something like this. Something like that. And the bass player in the concert that I lifted the bass line from was doing. Then he comes. It's a funky bass line. So I try to put those two together. I emulate this those two strings and then I I something like this. Like I said, I don't have it down yet. Anyhow, mess around with it and if somebody figures it out, send it to me. Thanks. That's it.